West News Tony Atkins uh, is live now in the first warning weather lab. He's actually in Cocoa Beach. Uh, Tony, what are you seeing out there? Yeah, we just were allowed in a few moments ago by the cops. They had a really large perimeter because power lines are down in this area where these, you know, strong winds really uh, had a significant impact. I do want to show you some of the damage here live. This is a wide shot of it, but let's get in closer here. Uh, we're looking at the urgent care and you can see a number of those emergency vehicles. But right here at this point, this is a super cuts location with significant damage. You can see uh, just how much damage has been done to the windows, to the interior. And also, if we could just go off to the uh, to the left here, you can see a, a fire truck right there. That's the only light that you're seeing in this area here uh, on Cocoa Beach because it's so dark. The power lines have been down. Police they did allow us through but they're not letting us off of this parking lot which is like a plaza because they are still working to get uh the the power situation under control in the area but again just significant damage we were hearing this on the scanner as we were over in merritt island and earlier when i was in merritt, merritt island or coming over the causeway that's when we got the alert about the warning for uh, this tornado. So just a really scary situation. And then to, you know, watch it pass and then come over finally to see the amount of damage. Uh, just really uh, significant striking uh, images here. And this is just one location. So once uh, the power line situation is under control, the road's going to reopen safely. And then we will be able to see damage to other businesses here in the area. But again, this is just one location uh, with some serious uh, damage here. So we're gonna stay on top of the weather situation as it develops here in Brevora County. But again, this is just one building. We're gonna move around, hopefully get some shots and show you some more damage. But again, a tornado warning in this area left behind uh, uh, some pretty serious damage here.